Hi everyone, welcome to week four of the Thanksgiving journal tag and the last week of the tag. Um, welcome, you're here. Um, well, this week um, is obviously a week of transition into December, um, which is exciting. <laughs> um, so this week's prompt, I guess, is mashed potatoes and mac and cheese the comfort foods so this is basically all about the rest of this month and going into next month because i'm sure all of us are excited for this holiday season because we could all use a little bit of joy and jolly goodness so let's get started this is also sort of a combination of journaling and like a regular kind of tag so i'd like to get to know you guys <clears throat> So the first question is, what is your best Thanksgiving memory? Um, when I was a kid, I don't exactly remember how old I was. There was like a Flintstones marathon on, on Thanksgiving. Um, and this used to not be my room. Um, I used to, my room used to be the guest room and this room used to be the guest room. So when this was the guest room, I came in here and watched the Flintstones marathon and it was super nice outside. Um, so, like, we opened up all the windows and everything, and my grandparents were here, and we just had, like, a classic Thanksgiving meal, and I really cherish those kinds of moments. Do you have any Thanksgiving traditions? Um, yes. Uh, last year that tradition was broken, unfortunately, because my dad had surgery, but every Thanksgiving we get the deep fryer out. Um, which a lot of people judge my family for. I don't blame you. It's just what I've grown up with, basically. Um, and uh, my dad deep fries a turkey. I know a lot of people are like, you have to bake it, you can't, I don't know. I don't even eat turkey, okay? Don't blame me. <laughs> um, but you know, we'll like deep fry uh, tater tots, french fries, tasty stuff, basically. And that's always like, just the day that I allow myself to indulge and just eat a bunch of fried food. <laughs> um, what are five things you're thankful for? And after you respond, I urge you to write about those things in your journal. Five things I'm thankful for off the top of my head. My boyfriend, my health, my family, my cat, but I guess that's part of my family. So I'll do something different. Um, my journals and that I'm alive. I'm grateful. Um, and now we're gonna get into December. So show your supplies for December so far. I know this part of the video is probably gonna be really long for some of you guys out there. So. You guys are gonna see this in um, my vlog video um, that I'll be coming out with probably on Thursday or Friday. Um, so yeah, I have these, which I'm probably gonna use to count down for um, Christmas. I have a bunch of these stickers. They're really funny. Some of them are like Santas with like masks and stuff like that, so. Um, I'm excited to use those. I have like a bunch of just Christmassy stickers, Christmassy stickers. I'm definitely going to be doing a lot of like decorate with me videos, um, in December. That's for sure. Um, I have these tags. I used these in my pen pal letters a couple of years ago. Which I'm, by the way, I'm getting back into pen palling. Um, kind of, I'm really nervous about it, but I'm trying to get back into it a little bit. So, um, feel free to DM me on Instagram. My Instagram is Cozy Little Papers. Um, and my profile picture is like a rose. So, go and find me. And so we can become pen pals. I have these. I got these a couple of years ago. I want to say they're from like 2018, but they're like googly eye um, stickers. 
I don't know. Like, I'm not going to use these in my journal. I don't think. But we'll have to see. <coughs> um, this is a bunch of stickers that I got on eBay. Just a bunch of really, really cute stickers. These are all from, um, the, these that I'm showing you are all from the same person. So those are those. And then these are all vintage stickers that I got from someone else on, um, you can see my leaf from, um, eBay. And some of these are absolutely gorgeous most of them are and I'm like really excited that I have the chance to use these and some of them are just absolutely to die for um, so I'm really excited to use these um, I hope I'm not planning on using every single one of them um, for Christmas, but I feel like I had something to say. I'm not going to use all of them this year, probably. I'm probably going to save some for next year, too. That's what I was going to say. And the next question is... What journal will you use? It looks like I'm gonna be using this one. Um, this is like an ornament that I wanna put a picture in and put on the front. And this was from like a present box, which is why that's there. I'm probably gonna cover it with like a, like a sticker or something. So, and this is just a composition book. I'm not positive yet though. I, I'm not sure if these pages will be a bit too big and overwhelming to me, but we'll have to see. What challenges do you plan on participating in? Um, I know there's like a few challenges that are going on next month, and I'd like to participate in pretty much all of them. Um, so we'll have to see what I actually participate in. Um, we'll have to see. Um, and I'm also going to be doing a readathon. It's not too intense, though. So, I mean, yeah. I haven't been reading enough this year, so I wanted to do a readathon because the readathons kind of give me a little bit more structure and, like, a, a push to read. Um, what's your favorite washi tape? This would be my favorite washi tape. It has little elephants and polka dots on it. It has a good memory behind it. Um, I think it was like the second time I ever um, video called my boyfriend. He made me put this on my fingers because I used to have like a really bad problem with like biting um, the skin around my fingernails, which is like kind of gross. But you know, I mean, it was just a habit. So he made me put the, he said, go put that around your fingers so you don't do that. So I did and it was just a cute moment and I try not to use it, um, but yeah, that's that. Favorite pen. Now, this is the one I have been using for years. I actually just got some brown ones, um, and I prefer the brown ones, but I can't find them. So I'm gonna go with this, but these um, Energel Liquid Gel Ink Pentel Refillable Pens are my absolute favorite. Favorite journal ever would be this one. It's so thick. I put so much in here and there's so much like self-discovery in here. I'm just so glad that I had this and this gave me so much space. Like this thing is huge. It's like bigger than my head. Um, and it just gave me so much space to get to know myself, if that makes sense. So, this one I will always cherish, basically. Yeah. 
And then last question is, what do you plan on doing this holiday season? I just plan on staying home. Um, please don't go out, please. But at home, I mean, I have like an advent calendar that I'm super excited to do. I'm gonna watch lots of movies. I'm super excited about that. Um, I'm gonna obviously decorate the tree. I'm gonna journal every day. I'm just, I love the holiday season. It just makes me so like happy. And I know that for some people it makes them really depressed, but it just makes me so happy. So that's what I'm looking forward to. So yeah, that's the Thanksgiving journal tag. I hope you guys enjoyed these few weeks. Please, if you make a response video, leave the link in the comments so that I can make sure that I see it. Um, Creative Jewels has been keeping up with this tag and you go girl. Um, but I'd love to see your responses. If and, even if you don't wanna to respond to this, if you make journaling videos, please leave a comment down below because I really want to subscribe to more people who make journaling videos. I guess that's about it. Um, yeah, thank you guys for coming along this month and I hope you all have a fantastic Thanksgiving if you celebrate it. And here's to December. Bye guys.